Well, Katiana, we are in New Iberia as we have spent our entire morning covering tornado damage that's taking place across Iberia Parish, especially here in New Iberia with all signs pointing to, after speaking with meteorologist Chris Cozart, a possible EF2 tornado touching down in Iberia Parish. The damage done across Iberia Parish by Wednesday's severe weather and tornadoes leaving parts of New Iberia in a bad spot, with buildings damaged, power lost, homes and apartments destroyed. But cleanup efforts are underway here in New Iberia, and it's going to take our area and volunteers from across the country to help this community get back on its feet. An isolated incident like this, what's in the middle of it is catastrophic. There's a lot of cleanup that needs to be done here in New Iberia. These homes, um, they were decorated for Christmas. We've seen Christmas trees through walls. Um, this is this is going to be devastating for the families. Catholic Charities of Acadiana working with volunteers from as far as Kansas. We've already had folks reach out to us from the Midwest, from states that have experienced tornadoes. They know what it's like. They're they're actually pointed south right now on their way to help us, and so we're excited to have them come in with our debris removal and our tarping efforts. We're going to be here for a while. Acadiana, if you or anyone you know is interested in the cleanup efforts taking place in Iberia Parish, you're encouraged to reach out to Catholic Charities of Acadiana. Ben Broussard telling us that it is extremely important that Acadiana residents come and help out their brothers and sisters in New Iberia. In Iberia Parish, I'm Gerald Quinnick. You're watching Caleb News 10.